Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I will show you how we can manage OneDrive for cloud user via Microsoft in June. So previously I have made a video for OneDrive like how we can configure OneDrive on Windows Server and deploy it to the users so OneDrive we can set OneDrive automatic login with users Windows credential we can back up Windows non folder automatically in OneDrive uh, or we can silently move Windows non folder to OneDrive so if users save something on their desktop documents or picture that will be automatically moved to OneDrive. So the OneDrive team is continuously working to improve OneDrive features and automations in Intune as well. So in my this video, I will show you how we can automate OneDrive and deploy OneDrive policy for all of our users. So let's go to the Intune dashboard and then into configuration profile so that I will show you the options of OneDrive. The options we can set to automate our OneDrive. <coughs> okay, let's type here Intune. You can go to Intune by typing here Intune.microsoft.com as well. Okay, now the Intune dashboard is getting open. Once you are in the dashboard, then go to devices. Okay, the video I was showing you on the screen, my YouTube video, that was about Active Directory users and computer. We have deployed OneDrive for Active Directory users and computer via group policy object on a Windows server. So here I will show you that how we can deploy OneDrive for our cloud user. The users who are on Intune having company devices with Intune registered. So we will have them automatically log in to OneDrive using their Windows credential and we will set up also move Windows non folder to OneDrive automatically. I go to Intune Home then devices and after devices we have to go to configuration profile so that we can configure a profile. For our OneDrive, I will go and create a new policy here. The platform I want to select is Windows, then and later. Now we have to go to templates. After going to templates, we can go to administrative templates. So, on Windows Server, we, we were doing this in group policy and in Tune, we are doing in configuration profile for our cloud users. Okay, let's name one drive policies. Okay. Hit next. You can search here as well, right? You will find the option of OneDrive here, okay? And also, you can type here OneDrive. Okay, I have typed here OneDrive and I am getting too many options here in the computer configuration. Right, I can go to all settings, I can go to users, 
configuration but I want to go to computer configuration and then I want to open this OneDrive folder here the first thing I want here that silently move Windows non folder to OneDrive so first I want that our any of our user is logged in on a window device and this policy will get synced to their device in some time and their windows non folder will be moved automatically to OneDrive and start getting synced we can select show notification to users after folder have been redirected to yes or no so better to select no as it's automatic process and this will move windows non folder automatically to the cloud okay the first thing i have select the second thing i want to select is i want user get login to one drive with their windows credential the credentials the email basically they are using login to computer so i want user i want that the those users will automatically logged in to computer logged into one drive using windows credential and that will be automatic process here i can see the option of silently sign in users to onedrive app with their windows credential so this is also the perfect policy to be applied that if a user gets login into a laptop or a computer with their email right and the device must be registered to Intune so they will automatically get login to their OneDrive from here right OneDrive will appear here and that will automatically get login and after getting automatic login after getting automatic login Windows non folder will start getting synced automatically there are many other options you can select here and apply but last option i want that i want to exclude specific kinds of file from being uploaded to onedrive this is also the perfect policy we usually use in our environment that we don't want to upload file which end with .exe, which end with .msi, right? Setup files. We can select other files as well. If you can see here, JPEG, JPEG, or PNG, or any other file that will not get synced to the cloud automatically, and they will get excluded. Okay. hit next I will again hit next assignment you can use add all users at all devices so better to select add all devices and add all users as this policy is very useful for everyone you can also exclude groups here as well so I will select all devices and all users here hit next okay review and create so i have only selected these three policies and i have enabled them silently move windows non folder to onedrive silently sign in users to onedrive sync app with their windows credentials 
and excludes specific kind of files from being uploaded. Remember there are many other options you can select or enable. This was just about explaining you that usually we set up only these three options. So let's hit create and it's saving. Give it few seconds. Okay. So once you create the policy, right, and you apply that, this is just for your understanding that we have applied, we have already applied one drive auto login and sync policy and that policy we can see success rate here error conflict and all of the details here right if i click on the success i can see the users and email whose one drive is successfully gets login automatically whose windows non folder are getting synced to one drive cloud automatically and there's specific kind of files are getting excluded the file that we have selected to get excluded so the policy we have created just right now the OneDrive policy this could take some time right to propagate between the devices and the users and we will see the results or you can set the logs here that's it about onedrive automation or how we can manage onedrive via microsoft in tune and onedrive is perfect feature perfect sync feature in microsoft so that the data could get sync automatically to the cloud it will, it will keep our data in the cloud or if we lose a device or if our device gets corrupted the data will still remain in the cloud and up to date thanks for watching thanks for your time keep watching keep sharing bye